Now, if we want to have a sphere centered at x naught, y naught, z naught, a sphere of radius r with center x naught, y naught, z naught, then we can say that the point x, y, z is on the sphere if and only if the distance from x naught y naught z naught to x y z, which we could represent as the magnitude of this vector, if that distance is r, if and only if the distance is r. The distance we know to be the square root of x minus x naught squared plus y minus y naught squared plus z minus z naught squared and that distance should equal r. If we square both sides we get the equation x minus x naught squared plus y minus y naught squared plus z minus z naught squared equals r squared and we call this the equation of the sphere. This is the equation of a sphere of radius r center x naught y naught z naught. So here's our equation and what this equation means is that if we have the coordinates of a point x, y, z that satisfies these conditions, whatever x naught, y naught, and z naught are, their x naught, y naught, and z naught are going to be specific numbers uh, like 2, 4, 5 up here. If we have a set of values of x, y, and z that when plugged into this calculation we get r squared then that point will be on the sphere of radius r centered at the point x naught y naught z naught and if a point is on the sphere then if we plug its coordinates into this equation we're going to get an identity.